I pooped in the class. Good morning! Happy Wednesday. Is it Wednesday? I think it is. I'm all thrown off because I work from home. What day? Monday? I went to work Tuesday. Yeah, it's Wednesday. What are these people doing? This person doesn't understand that that stop sign is optional. Like, everyone who lives here does not stop at that stop sign. It's optional. I am so late. It's 9.15. <laughs> I just didn't want to wake up. And I, didn't, I went to bed early, too. But Oh, my God, the light's green. You are ruining my life. You ruined my life. Everyone, look at this lady. She ruined my life. She is a life. A ruiner. The light was green. It's never green. She stopped at the optional stop sign and now I have to wait at the red light and it's 9.15. It takes me 15 minutes to get to work. Oh yeah, I woke up and then I was like, I don't want to wake up. So I snooze. I never like snooze because I didn't have my Fitbit on last night because it died. Well, it was going to die so I had to charge it. It lasts for like five days, but I let it charge overnight. So it usually wakes me up. So I just snoozed my alarm and I never did I did it three times. So that's a half hour because I have it set for 10 minutes. Even Bentley was like, get out. You got to go work and make money so you can buy me all the toys. And he's mad at me because I have to put the cone of shame on him because he can't wear a onesie all day because he's going to pee on it. He, like, he acts normal and then I put it on him and he's just like so pathetic. It's so cute. Hopefully he'll just sleep. Oh. Then we're gonna go to school tonight for obedience class. I don't know. I don't know. It says like he can't do a lot of exercise, but like last night he was so freaking hyper and running around and like crashing into the wall just because he didn't have the cone on and he was cooped up. So I took him for a walk and he was fine. So I don't see why he can't go to class. I'm gonna put a onesie on him. And I go to a really good school. <laughs> Like the vet tech call and I was like asking him questions like he called to follow up and I was asking him questions and I was like do you think he'd go to class Wednesday night and he's like I don't think that would be a good idea where do you go to class I was like CPT and he was like oh that's the creme de la creme of obedience school in this area so yeah he can go and I was like duh you think I'm gonna send my kid to like a public school at like pet smart no honey he's gonna go to private school like his mommy did actually it's really i think it's like 80 bucks more where i go but they're really good like i love the trainer i have i think her name is karen she's the one that taught the puppy class and i like her she's been a trainer for 23 years she has all kinds of awards and medals and i've seen her with her dog doing demos and I like her better than the guy. There was a guy at the pet store and he is a certified trainer, but I just don't like that environment that you're in a store. I like, you're just like in a corner in a store and people are watching you like you're at a zoo. I don't like it, so. We go to CPT training. And I think I'm gonna just do all the levels of obedience with him, like if I have the money, cause it's kind of expensive. It's like one, I think I paid, Puppy class was 50 bucks for two classes. And obedience one, I think is, it was like 180. But it's like 140 at, it's like 120, 140 at Petco and PetSmart, so it's really not a big difference. And Petco and PetSmart, you only get six classes. This one is an eight week class. I don't know why I'm talking about this. Cause who's interested? Not y'all. Oh my God, I'm not even on the highway yet and it's 919. And I asked my freaking supervisor if I could come in early on Wednesdays so I could leave 10 minutes early because I leave at like 6 and class starts at 7 and there's always traffic so I have to go home and get him. And I'm going to be late today. Like, go me. Hi, I'm responsible. Right here, responsibility. I don't know what my problem is. Do you like my Zoe? It's still here. Her name is Nola for New Orleans because that's where... That tainted water got all up in my face. I need, I'm gonna have to drive and just 
deal with the consequences of getting a ticket. I have a lead foot and it's really bad. Because I don't know what the random dance break was about. Because uh, actually, I don't know why I'm talking so much this morning. My first, well not my, I think it was like my first boyfriend. He taught me how to drive. Because I was all like, he had a he had a car, he had a Maxima, and he's and he saw Maxima. And he was like all about his Tims and his rims and his tints. And I was like, I want to drive, I want to drive your car. If you really like me, you'll let me drive your car. And he was like, okay. And I learned how to drive in Queens, New York, right on Francis Lewis Boulevard. He let me drive his car. I didn't even know the difference between the brake and the gas. And he let me drive for the first time on a, the, one of the busiest major roads in Queens. And that's how I learned how to drive. And then so he just taught me how to drive. So, hey Rodney, thank you, I appreciate it. Thanks, hun. But we broke up, obviously. I won't say why, but we broke up. And he broke up with me on my birthday. Well, he didn't break up with me on my birthday. He told me what he did on my 20, I think my 21st, my 20th birthday. Probably my 19th birthday, because I don't think I was that old. Yeah, he told me what he did in an email on my birthday, and he ruined my birthday. So, we still, like, we're friends now, but every year my birthday, I, like, tease him for ruining my birthday. Hello, mi gente. Bentley, you want to tell everybody what you did in school today? Yeah. You weren't looking at my signs, and you thought I was just, you thought I had, like, ADD, and I wasn't focusing, but... I, was, I wasn't chasing my dad. I had to poop. And you weren't listening to me, so you know what I did? I pooped in the class. Yeah, I, I did. I had to poop, and I told her she didn't listen. Yeah, my kid pooped in class on week two. This is his fourth, fourth week of class. He's feeling extra brave right now, and he thinks he can jump off the couch. I don't want to encourage that, because is like he looks so sturdy, because he's so fluffy. But, I mean, he's only, well, he's only the six pounds, 6.3 pounds. So, and his legs are so tiny. Look at those little chicken legs, because the front of his legs are shaved. He's so tiny, he can break some bones, so we don't want him jumping yet. Honey, that's your outfit. Drop it. Good boy. Yes. So, we just finished... I feel bad. I just groomed the heck out of him. He's getting all these knots around his neck. And it's from this stupid POS. Yeah, stupid POS shame of con cone of shame. So I ended up having to cut them out. That's how much. Anybody want some Maltese hair? You can use it for your extensions, girl. I got one bundle, $45. Pure Remy Maltese hair. So yeah, I had to cut it out and I don't even have like legit tools. I just craft scissors. But you're so fluffy, you can't even see the holes. I think I got them all out. I feel one more. I don't even, you, you can't see it, but I feel one more, but I'm just gonna leave it because I literally have been trying to brush, brush him out for like, Probably like a half hour. That's too long for a purpose. What happens when you when he gets a mat? It starts to it gets closer to the skin, and it just gets tighter and tighter, and then it'll pull his skin in, hurt him. Maybe we're gonna have to give you a legit puppy cut next time. He wanted to. Oh, did I show you guys his scar of shame? Uh, show everybody your junk. Your junk. Yeah, I don't like the way. Ow! Yeah, I have no life. Like, I have nothing to talk about but him today. And that's pretty sad. I do miss my bears, though. What is on the TV? It's so dramatic. I'm gonna call it a night because I have absolutely nothing to vlog about. Bentley and I were watching something about bears. Rawr, since he's a Bentley burr. And then he decided that he wanted all his toys out. Ooh, we're having some problems here. Okay, yeah. He, we were watching bears. He wants all the toys. He's my bubba, so he can get all the toys. And what is he doing? Oh, he found his Kong that I made so nice for him. Hey, Bentley, we're going to end tonight's vlog. Say bye to all your friends. 
I pooped in class today. I embarrassed you. <laughs> Pay attention next time. Um, bye guys. I'm gonna go play with this because this toy is really cool. There's there's something so smelly, yummy inside. I think it's um the ch dried chicken treat. Um, I don't know, but it's in there and I just can't figure out how to get it out. So I'm gonna play with this. I really love this. I love it so much. If she threw it, if she threw it, I would run for the world. Oh, a cable fell out. Uh, bye guys. I'm really busy. Bye.